Over the summer, Corey Evitt, who serves on the board of directors, decided to ride all 16 routes that Carter provides. Can you kind of talk to me and elaborate about what kind of inspired you to uh, uh, ride all 16 routes that Carter offers? Yeah, so when I came onto the board, there was obviously a lot of information thrown at us and a lot of learning we had to do really quickly. But I felt in order to make like the most informed decision, I needed to experience what everyday riders were experiencing. Evid got to experience what it felt like waiting for a bus, how the routes operate, and got to hear feedback from other riders who depend on public transportation. I've had really deep conversations with riders that want to express like how they think the system should be better. Um, there was a guy on his way to his job that expressed like, hey, I'm likely going to be late because we need this route to be a little bit earlier. And so we've made some adjustments and we're looking to make further adjustments um, to take into account those personal experiences. We live in a time where you have Uber, Lyft, and so many different ways uh, you can get around. Uh, why is it still important that people know that public transit is here and that they still can use it? I mean, first of all, it's way cheaper. I mean, if you looked at Uber or Lyft lately, it is the price has become astronomical. So Carta is way safer, way cheaper. Um, but we just need to, where we need to compete as public transit is in the convenience side. Not all Carter bus stops have a place for riders to sit while they wait. So Evan decided to take matters into his own hands. He was inspired by Chattanooga Urbanist Society to build benches for people to sit and wait. And what I found out after joining the board is that we get a $50 stipend as a part of volunteering for the Carter Board of Directors. And so that $50, I essentially turned into one of these benches. It's about 30 bucks in lumber. And then when you take into account the wood screws, uh, the paint, all that good stuff, it, it, it's about 50 bucks. So each month that I get that check, I turn it into one of these benches. Evan started back in February when joining the board and will continue for the next five years while he's on it. It's always a good feeling to uh, put one of these out and see them in use. But the best feeling in the world is gonna be when I can come out here and take this away and we can build a full-size uh, shelter that'll keep people outside of the elements. For Local 3 News, I'm Dallas Payton.